Hello my friends and welcome to episode 11 of our Motorsport Manager career mode with Predator Racing. We're starting today off first race of the season at the Black Sea. Now we know Baotang is going to struggle with this first lap. We've only got uh, race trim level 2 and obviously we do not have the perks because we've got new uh, mechanics to build relationships with and whatnot. Setup's okay. I'm a bit worried about our tyres here. We're only going to do 6 laps. We're going to struggle. We are going to struggle in that sense. I probably should just be practicing on the hard tires. Um, let's be honest. Are expecting rain today, so actually we can go soft. Uh, that's fine. Soft it is. Um, hmm. Yep. Soft. Yeah. About lap six. So that's fine. Uh, we did get those new brakes, so we do have slightly more reliable brakes. We're more reliable than the ones we started with. We've got another set building, which will be another improvement. Did have to make compromises on various things in regards to parts. So we do not have a good car and a bad car. This is where I prefer to have a number one and a number two. But truthfully, I would rather have two happy drivers. And right now we've got equal status drivers. So overall, longer term. I think getting a number two is more important, but they, you know, both these guys are important for us financially. Um, we are still improving the car. I think we need to get over that 150 mark. That 150 mark seems to be the benchmark. Obviously, that's the stock part price uh, bit. And I think you need about 300s to really get promoted here. Uh, so, realistically, winning the championship second season. It's not in the cards for us this year, year unfortunately. Uh, Frankie Kinney doing a decent job here, though. You do see that little yellow hint on the, the um, front wing sometimes. You see it there. You can see that little yellow that I've added to the livery from last year. That's just my little touch. I quite like it. So hopefully we can get two lap six out of this. We aren't ideal in terms of our tyre wear and stuff. Uh, it's really bad really really bad um, let's be honest uh, I don't know why we're so filled up here in terms of thingy um, we will pit Frankie kind of committed to that now so I hope he's not past the pit lane how long are we expect the Ninters for? not long we do not need anything other than tyres here he's past the pit lane sausages ah <sighs> Right, we'll bring bow in lap after, basically, and go straight on to the wets. Save him a pit stop. In fact, we'll just stack him and put him straight onto the wets. Um, and we'll fill him back up to 12 laps worth of fuel. He is the second driver, so do not overtake your teammate, mate, because that would be a disaster for us right now. You are stacking. I'm trying to save you a pit stop to try and make this a bit better. That was good, that was good. So we need to keep an eye on Bao Tang, eh, not Bao Tang, Frankie Kane, who is up in 15th place just now against Tang in 20th, but Tang obviously got caught behind Frankie in the pits there. So we are continuing on in the enters. We want to get about three laps out of him here um, on the enters to make it worthwhile. Obviously, Tang does not need to make another stop. The guys on the super soft tyres are on the wrong tyre now. Frankie Kinney running in 13th, which is great for us. Um, they are all making their stops now, and they will go straight to it, I would imagine, to save them the extra pit stop. So it's not really gained us anything. Hopefully, we can, you know, run through another couple of laps. We can punch the uh, high engine mode just now, but we're in fourth. That's fine. We'll pit him now. We're not got enough to justify that, unfortunately. And we will match out and fuel as well because we've got no other information other than that this is going to last a fair bit of time. So pit again for Frankie Kane. Yeah, in fact, I'm going to bring you back onto medium fuel. That's fine. Uh, and I think the only option I had to change tyre wear was to reduce it further and increase tyre heating. Realistically, I would want it the other way around. Um, lose the tyre heat in. Fine. Because of the way I use the push. Uh, we actually need to bring you onto medium, medium. 
and we can see how long these tires last. Hopefully we can jump some people in pits now as other than our drivers stop. We did definitely get our stops at the right time. It's just really the damage. So we'll follow by Tang. I think it's worth 1.6 million a race for us just now on current sponsorship deals uh, from what it said at the start. So, you know, that's a lot of money. That's an engine every single race. And we're not going to create an engine every single race. So we're going to try and get our upgrades as quickly as we can. Punch out the performance. Get our stuff for next season. Punch out the performance in them. And then, you know, work from there. Boutang doing a decent job here in 16th uh, right now. Of course, his teammate on a vastly different strategy. We are seeing that it's going to start to calm down soon. So, I'm going to get you to conserve those tyres. I want you to get another sort of three, four laps out of them at least. And right now, we're not looking likely on that one. We'll give him an inter stint soon um, and do it sort of the opposite way to what we've done. Frankie uh, Kinney. We did end up keeping the reserve driver. I can't remember her name now. Emily maybe shrinks the bell. I don't think it is though. Um, but we kept her. Uh, she actually initially left off her contract. Then she left and she's like, I can't believe you didn't offer me a new contract. And I'm like, I did. Uh, she cut off those talks, but then she instantly signed. She had on less money than what she was last season. Not a huge difference. Uh, but a nice long contract now as well. Um, but again, options to terminate that if we need to. We're still fighting down here with these uh, Dragon Team Racing cars, uh, unfortunately, at the back. As long as we don't finish last again, I think that's a improvement. But I think we'll get stronger as the season goes on here. I think we've made good improvements and getting that factory for us was huge. Uh, and I think we're going to have reliability improvements this year as well. We can now bring you back onto medium. And we can probably push the tyres. We'll bring you in at the end of this lap actually. Uh, fuel options, we will fill you up for about 5 laps. Six laps. We'll go for six. And it'll be done by 22, so no, we don't need that much. We'll go for that. And then, tyre choice of inters. Brand new set of inters, that's fine. Pep. Frankie Kenny has gone through. I'm going to try and hold him off. In fact, no. We'll get you a set of inters as well. One lap of fuel. In fact going to bring you straight on to this we'll wait another lap actually we'll do that and then we'll do his repairs at the same time because he will have repairs uh, unfortunately reliability not quite where we need it to be but hopefully that's where we gain positions on other people as we improve that we can bring you back onto this and we can really attack those tires actually action no cancel uh, Frankie right pet straight on the dries and what I want to do is fill you right up because I'm kind of hoping we can get you to the end fix these parts the engine shouldn't need done actually that won't need done 27 31 go for these two that shouldn't need done because we're going to be fairly relaxed on things so that shouldn't need done uh, you are attacking, so that's fine. You're actually doing reasonably well here, Boutang. In fact, you're actually going faster than the leader at the moment. In fact, the leader is blocking you getting past. Please don't just automatically blue flag here, because that would be annoying. Uh, how's repairs getting on? That's fine. You just lapped your teammate or just overtaking him. Just overtaking him, I think. Okay, I want to get maybe one more lap here. We can go into high mode because we will be making repairs. Um, we're on a damp track now, so this is definitely into dry tyre weather. Again, I want to kind of try and get you to the end, so 11 laps worth of fuel is what we need. Uh, we will repair that and that this time. Now, that's a longer pit stop. In fact, no, we won't repair that. We're going to gamble on just the suspension here. It's a bit of a gamble, uh, but we're going to go medium fuel and conserve tyres on Frankie Kane and uh, we will do the same here on Boutang, we're trying to get to the end on this stint uh, you know, Boutang overtaking people what a hero 
Uh, but he does come in now. That's his pit stop. Can Frankie get close to him? I don't think he will can. As much as he was ahead, it's a much shorter uh, pit stop. Oh, he does indeed get ahead. Right, so medium. Medium can serve. Uh, getting excess fuel here, actually, so that's fine. So we're not getting excess fuel there. Yeah. Um, so we'll go low fuel just now on Frankie. Try and maintain that. Then barely in the pits getting repairs, so we should be able to jump there. That's good. Um, in fact, that's very good. That's working out fairly nicely for us just now. Blue flags everywhere. Can we maintain with these guys? I think in the wet we were doing better. Well, there's now that it's dried out, we're not. We can maybe jump Van in though. That's good. Um, obviously, the repairs hurt us, but everyone else should be having to repair here. Oh god. Right, we're going to have to come in and repair that. We do not have a choice. I said it was a gamble. And it's not paid off for Bautang, unfortunately. I'll give him a fresh set of boots, though. Um, and he comes for those repairs. That's frustrating. He was having a good race as well. Or at least good fight, should I say. Um, we are still struggling though, you can see the team still struggling. Didn't get the improvements that I wanted to last year. I wanted to be 100 on everything and we hit 100 on nothing. So, the that sucks. Um, don't understand why we're not getting excess fuel now here. It should be good till the end of the race with Frankie. Um, in fact, why have you got so much fuel? You can sit on high now and probably neutral. Well, that was blue flags from miles out. Dreyfus has retired, so that's an extra place for us. Two cat. Rogers is pitied. Right, need to stay on low. I'm going to gamble and get into the end with Frankie here. Because I think we need to take that gamble. Hmm. I'm getting caught though very quickly by the car behind I don't like it I really don't like it and we're going to have to just yeah we've just got to pit fuel options give us an extra lap just in case we need a fixed part I, I said it was a gamble not to repair it but unfortunately it's not paid off Bao Tang now this is your chance to catch up son it means we are going to finish bottom two of the runners again because that gamble's not paid off. Is it going to come out in front? Just about. Boutang and Frankie Kinney racing each other. In fact, Boutang having a 2.4 race here. Where there is Kinney on a 6.2. Really interesting to see those ratings uh, when they come off like that. Mm. Can Kinney get past Boutang? I wonder. We are following Boutang just now. What issue have you got now, son? Frankie can eat. You can go into high, actually. Engine. That should have been fine. That really should have been fine. Um, we are actually going to push with you. <clears throat> Blue flags from miles out. And it's actually killed. These races, as Frankie Kinney comes through again, can he get through on the blue flag? Yes, he can. We will follow Frankie Kinney as he overtakes Boutang on his debut. We've got another lap here, <laughs> which is a bit mental. Um, no, we don't. Do we? No. <laughs> Garuda winning with Engelhart. It's always going to be a difficult season, this one. But we should be doing better than that. That is a very, very poor start, indeed. I was kind of hoping to see a bit of progress. Now, I know that was reliability that kind of bit us there. But I was hoping to see a bit more. And that was unfortunate. Hmm. ZRT up in six miles ahead of us already. That is a shame. But we do improve as the season goes on. Hopefully we can make big leaps again. And, you know, really improve the car for next season. I was kind of hoping it'd be promoted within three. I kind of think we're looking at four now, realistically. 
um, driver form 4.9 and the uh, mechanic relationship improves on both so that's good we are in big regression here with Frankie so we aren't going to get another season out of him 1.6 million pound in the kitty though that is going to pay for some improvements um, but guys that's new from new breaks but as well thank you all so much for watching i hope you enjoyed if you did hit like hit subscribe and tune in next time for the munich grand prix